Get out of our way. Stop. Jealous. Stop. Enough. Enough. That's it. We're done. Money. What's, What's up, up Anoka? Anoka? It's Romel, and it's Tuesday, September 17th. And I'm Ava. Welcome back to the news on the Victory Tuesday. You're not Ava. <laughs> My bad, guys. I'm Queen. Welcome back to the news on Victory Monday. Our top story is for those who, who are planning attending a post-secondary institution after graduation. Please consider applying to the Anoka Halloween Youth Citizenship Scholarship. The scholarship is based on students' civic accomplish accomplishments, community, volunteerism and or leadership. The reci recipients will earn $2,000 and be recognized at our Pumpkin Bowl football game. Applicants were sent to all seniors via email. Please see Ms. Neary in the College and Career Center if you have any questions. Rally Crew are sponsoring our annual Senior Sunrise on the Wednesday morning of Homecoming Week. This event has been in tradition in recent years with every year bigger than the year prior. Seniors, let's make this the best year attended. Lighthouse is an after-school program that is available for students to work on school assignments, projects, and studying for facts. It will run on Mondays and Tuesdays during the school year in room SC171. Light Lighthouse starts at 2.30 and students will need to stay until 4.30 unless they have other transportation picking them up at a different time. Bus transportation is provided at 4.40 each day. There will be staff available to help students with their schoolwork. Earlier this morning, we had a chance to catch up with the leadership team of the Spanish Honor Society. Let's hear from them. Hi, I'm Jade. And I'm Jessica. We're the head officers for La Sociedad Honoraria Hispanica. If you are enrolled in an Honor Spanish course for this year, Spanish 3, 4, or 5, you are eligible to join the Spanish Honor Society. We are a prestigious and academic club that focuses on learning about Hispanic culture, including holidays throughout the year. Activity and activities include crafts, cooking events, and more. If you're interested in joining the Spanish Honor Society, see one of the Spanish teachers, Profe Walls, Profe Rhymers, or Profe Bina, for an application or find one of us for more information. Thanks, ladies. Speaking of Honor Society, the National Honor Society is having their first meeting tomorrow, September 18th at 7.10 a.m. in the auditorium. This meeting is only for current members. All current members should plan on it to attend. Email Ms. Renfrey if you have any questions. Rock Climbing Club is back on for tomorrow at 6 a.m. in the Fieldhouse. It's an early start from 6 a.m. to 7 a.m. Go check it out and chat with Ms. A. Miss Ahart for more information. It's time for a look at the weather. Let's check in with Sarah. Thanks, anchors. You are not going to believe this, but the weather will stay warm for at least a few more days. However, today could bring some showers along with the possibility for a storm with the increase in humidity. The high should stay around 86 degrees. It should stay in the 80s until Friday when a cooling trend begins. Homecoming week looks pretty good so far. More on that tomorrow. I'm Sarah. Now back to our anchors. Thanks, Sarah. We're also joined earlier today by Millie McCaller with those involved with the Educators Rising. Let's hear from her now. Hey guys, if you have any passion towards education or kids, Educators Rising would be a great fit for you with lots of volunteer opportunities. We have our first meeting this Wednesday, September 18th in room 155, directly after school. If you have any questions, please contact Ms. Hale. We'd love to see you there. We are excited to announce that this Friday on the news, we will review the Spirit Days for next week homecoming. I cannot wait for that, for real, for real. Me neither. Neither can I. The Pickleball Club needs, to, needs this Friday. Neither can I. The Pickle Club meets this Friday morning in the Fieldhouse from 6 a.m. to 7 a.m. Miss Burnt is undefeated on the pickleball court and would love to have more students come down and have fun starting this Friday morning. Ramel would be there as well. Strong Women of Tomorrow will also meet this Friday morning in S114. See Miss Hoffman if you have any questions. New members are always welcome. Time for sports. Let's check in with Queen. Thanks, Inkers. Before giving you the rest of the sports, let's talk about tonight's girls' swim and dive team. Hey, Anoka. Today is the Anoka swim and dive home meet against Andover. Come on, show up. Starts at 6 p.m. over at Fred Moore Pool. We'd love to see you out there. Thanks for 
that message and good luck to the Queens of the Chlorine. In other sports news, the girls soccer team lost a tough one to Elk River last night, three to two. They face TG next. Boys soccer also lost their makeup game to Duluth East four to two. The volleyball game played a great game last night, but came up short to Champlain Park in five sets. They will take on Andover Wednesday. Hey Speechies, heads up and and for the information meeting uh, will help on Monday, October 7th with a makeup meeting on the 8th. Join speech, remind at speechy 23, see Mr. Anderson in room L126, speech feeder. Catch it. All the new current sp sp players interested in the girls lacrosse for 24-25 season, girls lacrosse is holding an informational meeting on September 24th at 2.30 in room 28. We will be going over fall fundraising and team buying. Any new current players should attend. We are very excited to see everyone. We will have more sports tomorrow. I'm Ava. Now back to our anchors. Wait, Wait a, a second. second. It's actually Ava, but Queen just wants to be here today. Remember, if you missed anything, be sure to subscribe to the Anoka TV News on the YouTube channel. Also, if you have a club or an event going on at school and that you want us to promote, talk to Mr. Anderson or any other member of the TV news crew. Today's lunch is General So's chicken. Yup, yup, yup. <laughs> well, that's, that's the news. Thank you for hanging out with us here at Anoka TV News. This is Queen. And I'm Romel. See you tomorrow. <laughs>